do subscribe to ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos student let us solve the next question number 41 need physics paper 2014 students let us solve the next question question number 41 it says hydrogen atom in ground state is excited by a monochromatic radiation of wavelength lambda which is given by this so i have a situation like this this is the energy level diagram of hydrogen atom this is the ground state which stands for n equals to 1 i have an electron in the ground state hydrogen atom in ground state this is a hydrogen atom in ground state is excited by a monochromatic radiation so that is a radiation which is incident on this which wavelength is lambda which is given by 975 armstrong so when we know that when electron jumps from higher level to lower level it emits radiation and the reverse process when it moves from lower to higher it has to absorb radiation and that energy is supplied by this wavelength whose wavelength is this the number of spectral lines in the resulting spectrum emitted will be now the energy levels are n is 1 here n is 2 here n is 3 here n is 4 this one is 4 5 so on up to infinity now we know the formula for energy in any energy level for hydrogen atom from bohr's theory we have found that the energy level e for any orbit is a uh, minus 13.6 divided by n square electron volt this is the expression for energy in electron volt where n stands for the number of orbits so for the first orbit n is 1 when n is 1 we have e equals to minus 13.6 electron volt but how much energy we are supplying that we have to first find now the energy that is incident is how much this is given by the expression how much is the expression the expression is uh, if i want to convert energy a uh, wavelength into energy then i have to 12400 this is 12448 something like that you can take 12448 or 12400 divided by wavelength in armstrong this is in armstrong and this energy should be in electron volt so the energy that is incident equals to 12448 okay this is 12448 and divided by the wavelength is 975 975 this is in armstrong so the answer will be in electron volt we want electron volt because this is there now if i solve this i have to use a calculator to find a what is the value just i have to use that 12400 divided by 975 so answer is uh, 12.76 something like that we are getting 12.76 electron volt now this uh, 12.76 electron volt i am applying and uh, in positive so how far this will go that the initially the energy is uh, having this one so if i apply this energy so the present situation in present situation minus 13.6 uh, plus 12.76 that comes out to be if i do that i just go for the calculation because these are minute calculations so i don't know to waste time 13.6 minus 12.76 the 0.8485 something like that around 0.84 okay is uh, 
minus 0 0.84 or 85 whatever it is 84 85 whatever approximately it is it can take us uh, minus 0 0.84 so that means uh, if this is the situation now where the atom is now that we have to see in this much of energy we know that this one is uh, minus 13.6 this this is the energy level is minus 13.6 this one will be minus 13.6 divided by n square that is 4 which is a uh, 3.4 minus this the next one is minus 13.6 divided by 9 which is a uh, minus 1.51 something like that that this one minus 13.6 divided by 16 which is a uh, um, 0 0.85 0 0.85 so this this energy 0 0.85 is obtained here in the fourth uh, orbit the fourth orbit 0 0.85 is obtained in the fourth orbit so we can say that the electron will get excited to this one from here to the fourth level fourth level if n is 4, now for this question, n becomes 4. If n is 4, how many such spectral lines possible? Then uh, this one is 1. From here to here. From here to here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And uh, we have uh, from here. Uh, one, two, you can have different type of spectral lines. One, two, three, four, five, and uh, from here to here, and here to here. These are same. We are not going to count this. Only one will be counted. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six because these are repeated. The repeated are not counted. This is out of these two, one is counted. And uh, this and this, one is counted. This is not counted. And the rest is okay. That means one, two, three, four, five, and six. Six should be the answer to this question. Now, let me just see this one this way. For uh, number of spectral lines we have to use the formula n into n minus 1 divided by 2 because it's the combination you have to check not the permutation the combination is uh, that for uh, a spectral line uh, to get we have to have uh, two uh, this is the nc2 formula because uh, jump is from one to another so all two different for a two different uh, pair of lines between two pair of lines so nc2 so the, if i use this formula n equals to 4 then 4 4 minus 1 divided by 2 which is 4 into 3 divided by 2 so it is 6 so this is the answer to this question so this is the formula that, that actually we are going to use but this is the uh, practically you can see here that uh, this is uh, physically you can see that uh, okay these are the things happening so answer to this question is uh, question number 41 the answer is 6 okay thank you